Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Crystal here. If you are new, thank you so much for stopping in. This is a different kind of video than I usually do, and I hope that you enjoy it. For those of you who are subscribed or who are return viewers, I appreciate your continued support, and I love that you're enjoying the content. Please feel free to subscribe if you have not yet done so. Hit that like button, uh, the notification bell, will send you a notification anytime that I upload new content so that you don't miss an opportunity to see new videos. And uh, the share button will allow you to share it to your, to your different types of media platforms. So without further ado, we are doing something a little different this morning. My son is graduating in May and we also have a trip to Florida in May. So I decided to dig out a couple of my project sheets because there's there's just a lot going on in May and my master list is getting master. <laughs> it's getting rather large. So I decided maybe I would just pull out some um, some of these project sheets. I got them in a D stash here oh, quite some time ago. They have like a little section for photo vision sketches project notes. This is a classic size. I do have some big size, but since I'm finding myself in my classic size printer most of the time currently, because of my daily sheets, I am doing this in my classic just to help me stay focused. If I find I don't have enough room, then we may move up to a big. So you guys are along for the ride. I'm going to work on the, the, the project sheet for my son's graduation. Um, he has chosen the colors of blue and gold. His graduating classes colors are um, maroon and gold. <laughs> so we are not, we're not sticking to the, the theme of the color that is of his class. We are, we're gonna go with the theme of the color that he has chosen for his graduation colors, like for his graduation party. I pulled out this book because, sorry, this book being The Color Story. We flipped through this before. I'm not going to do a flip through today, but I pulled this out because it had, where's it at? Where is it at? <laughs> I think I'm, I must have flipped right over it already, I guess. These, so I, I, these are what caught my attention at first, was this like blue because it's kind of a rich royal blue that he's looking at. And then when I was flipping through it the first time, <laughs> these caught my attention, these blue boxes. These have rose gold on them. So I may just use them even though they're not gold. <laughs> um, I may go ahead and use them. We shall see, we shall see. I won't need a whole lot anyways because this sheet is already kind of divided up for me. So let's just dive in here and see what happens. I also need to plan for our trip in, in um, May. I need to start making a packing list and all that too. There's just so many things. But I want to make sure that I'm getting everything organized and... Um, lined up because honestly I have really not been fantastic at that lately. So I was thinking these little washes, these brush strokes would go good over the words, but the words aren't showing through because they're on black background. Yeah. So I don't know that that's going to be a good idea. Don't know. <laughs> Let's just give it a go. Let's see if my Bujo pen, my Bujo, my Jelly Roll Sakura will write. On those stickers. It looks like it will. I mean, I'm probably gonna have to go over it a couple of times, but it does look like it's gonna write okay on there. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I'll let them dry. Maybe. 
Maybe I won't do that many of them because I don't have enough to cover all of the sections. So maybe I'll just do a couple. We'll just do a couple to just add some pops of color to the page. since we won't have enough to do to cover all of the words. That one actually kind of still shows through. I may not have to write on that one. You guys may not be able to see them showing through because you're so far away, but I can, I can see them showing through, so I may leave them. I'm not certain yet. We'll see. We shall see. And then I also brought out this Colorful Shapes book because it has all the golds. But I don't think gold is what we went with. I think silver is what he ended up going with. Because Dela said gold and gold and beige. And then when she called him to confirm, he's like, I thought you said gold and silver or gold and gray. Gold and gray instead of beige. <laughs> So I think we ended up with silver. So I think for this, I'm going to pop down some silver boxes. There's not silver boxes. Obviously, these are circle guys. I'm going to pop down some. Oh, I just tore that. What the heck? Why didn't that come up? Mmm. That makes me mad. Hopefully it'll stick down okay and I can kind of pretend like, I don't know guys. I don't think there's any more of those big circles either. I'll be able to pretend like it's not messed up. I guess that's as good as it's gonna get. Good thing that this is just a project sheet. Maybe I can put another circle over that to... Why are they... It's like they're not cut all the way. I'm not certain what's going on here. Yeah, it, they're all wanting to tear in this book. Happy Planner, what is going on? So just a bunch of circles in there. That's what I'm gonna do with that. We've got supplies on hand, supplies to purchase, and the details. I'm kind of thinking maybe I'll do some hexagons down the side here for the details. Because I know there are going to be some things we need to purchase. We did purchase a few things this weekend. I know I need to schedule some things and we're going to have to rent some things. So I'm just going to go ahead. Yeah, these are not cut all the way, these stickers in this sticker book. But this is an older sticker book, too. This is a colorful shape sticker book. And I got it on sale. So, photos, vision, sketches. I don't have any photos printed out yet. And then project notes. I think I'm going to do a strip down the side here. Let me see. Ooh, yeah. Like one of these big ones. Let's do... make sure it's gonna come out okay. Let's do this down the side. Or maybe, I, should I point it up? I think I should point it up. I'm gonna go up part way just in case I find a really cool quote to put in here. Cause I mean, it's graduation guys. says she's a dreamer. I could do something and cover up the S to make it he's a dreamer. What do you guys think? Or should I just do the time is now? I think I'll just do that. The time is now. I feel like this maybe needs to go like here 
bring some more blue to this front side. There we go. Yeah, I don't foresee anything else in here. These shapes, maybe. Are there any good quotes, though? Let's go see if there's a good quote in here that might... No, that's a different... So the quotes would be... I don't... I guess I don't reckon that they have a special quote section. Let's go see. Oh, dreams are for chasing. The quotes are all in rose gold. Well, that's not going to work. I mean, maybe we could. Could we get away from... Could, could we get away with it? Dreams are for chasing. Just stick it down here. <laughs> stick it down here with the rose gold anyways. I think we're going to. We're just going to do it. Rose gold. Silver. I, You know, who, who cares? Dreams are for chasing. All right. I think that's good for our project page. If you guys want to see me fill this out, let me know in the comments. And uh, I will not fill it out this evening. I will watch in the comments today and determine if I need to film a video of me filling filling this bad boy out with all of our graduation deets. Or if you guys just want to see an after the pen. So let me know in the comments. Video or after the pen? Video or after the pen? And that will indicate whether or not we're doing a video showing how we complete this project sheet for graduation, or if we're just gonna do an after the pen photo for you guys to see how I utilized this particular project sheet. I'm trying to write grad here for you. Before you see another photo, it will be filled in. I mean, the grad word will be. All right, let me know in the comments your thoughts, guys, gals, friends. Hopefully no foes. <laughs> and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Ciao for now.